We're in the Penguinarium, and it's breeding season. In fact, it's hatching season. We check the nest boxes every day for the penguins, and if there's a new egg, then we will pull it and weigh it and measure it, and then put it back out and let the parents rear it, if at all possible. The other morning, we came in and we pulled one of the eggs to check it, and it was almost done hatching. And so we actually were fortunate enough to bring it back and film the egg hatching. So usually we wouldn't be able to see an egg hatch, it would be hatching under the parents, but we were lucky enough to be able to witness this inside our kitchen and we just kind of put it back in the egg and then put it back under the parents and they got to watch it hatch as well. So when we check the penguin chicks, we're making sure that they're gaining weight like growing chicks should be, as well as staying hydrated and making sure that they don't have any injuries that need to be taken care of. So right now visitors actually won't be able to see our five new chicks. They're being cared for by the parents inside their nest boxes. However, in about three months, the chicks will fledge and come out into the exhibit and visitors will be able to see them. They don't have those distinctive black and white stripes that Humboldt penguins have. They'll be more gray-brown all over for the first two years of their life. Humboldt penguins are actually the most threatened of all the penguin species. The Oregon Zoo has been supporting conservation in Peru for over 10 years. So visitors can feel good when they come visit the penguins that they're helping support penguin conservation in the wild.